Hi everyone, it's Jadong, and in this video I'm going to show you how to carry your Minecraft Wii U Worlds to Minecraft Nintendo Switch Edition. Um, so just to let you know, first off, um, you need the Minecraft Nintendo Switch Edition, not the Bedrock version, which kind of sucks. So if you don't have this, I don't know if there's actually a way you can actually get this game. Uh, since it's like in 2019, but this game is not available for purchase anymore. So, and also, um, but what do I mean by, uh, syncing up to worlds? You can't, like, <clears throat> play on this one. You actually have to do it on Bedrock. That's the sad part. That's why I'm still mentioning about the Switch Edition, because you still need both of these. But either way, you'll get this one for free if you do have this one. It's, I know, it's complicating. <sighs> Anyways, so what you gotta do, um, let's just say I just want to create a new world. I'll just name this world, uh... I don't know, I would just call this Jadon. Because that's my name. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on, I'm pressing the wrong thing. Hang on. I'm looking for the camera, so uh, that's why I'm kind of typing very off. Uh, let's see. Jadon. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> now we got that. I'll just put this uh, creative. You know, I'm just going to create my own world and stuff like that. Uh, all this I don't care about since it's just a world. Yes. Alright, so while that's loading, you can uh, load up your Minecraft Nintendo Switch Edition. I'll just use this user. Alright, so now that's loaded. You know, wait till this uh, world creates. Oh yeah, and by the way, you can't send worlds from the Switch Edition to the Wii U. You can't do that. You can only do it from Wii U to Switch, which kind of really sucks in my opinion. Alright, so since we got this one, I'll just turn the volume down. There we go. Alright. So once this one's loaded up, uh, what you gotta do, uh, let me connect online. There we go. Alright. So, uh, on the Switch version, you press Y, transfer to, uh, transfer from, uh, save from Wii U. So, you press Y, and it's gonna ask you, sure you want to? Which I know is nothing that bad to do, so you just press OK. So you just wait for that. And while this freaking world is still loading, wow. Alright, so you just stay on this screen for a while. <clears throat> while, you know, I'm trying to create this world. I'm just skip this part, actually. Alright, finally. Now that the um, world is created. Alright, let's just, you know, recap on this world. Or just see what's in this. So you see there's a jungle biome over there. We got some mountains, waterfall, and everything. So, you're going to see this world on a Switch Edition. So, um... What you gotta do just exit and save. Don't exit without saving because your world is not gonna be saved. Uh, it's asking me to sure. Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay. Now is your world saving? Or any world actually. It can be any world. It doesn't have to be like a creative world or anything. It'd be survival, adventure, any world. Modded worlds? I'm not sure actually. I may need to do an experiment on that sooner in the next video. Alright, anyways. Um, let you see, I have a world named Jadom, that's the same as that world. So what you gotta do, you press X on your gamepad. And then you go down to where it says transfer, save to Nintendo Switch. Alright. So it's saying, are you sure, just like how the Switch is. Um, when it asks you that same exact question, like, I don't know how many times actually. But, <clears throat> just press OK. And as you see, it's transferring to save. It's looking for the next, uh, next door Switch. Or, you know, neighbor switch that's next by uh, Wii U. So now that we're on the switch, um, okay, well, um, <laughs> uh, my switch got, what in the world? Okay, well, um, let me restart the game because like, I can't press anything. I'm pressing B, Y, X, something like the background. I don't know. Let me just pause this. Okay, let's do this again without any failing. Just to let you know, you do need a uh, switch online to do this method too. Because uh, you need to be online for this thing. I believe so. I'm, I'm not sure. I just noticed I always had to be online when doing this. But, um, alright. So, once you do, like I said before, you press Y and you say, ask you, are you sure? Then, okay. Now you see. They're trying to look for next door, and as you see, it's uh transferring the worlds of the freaking camera. Don't stop being blurry. There we go. Ah, oh, that's perfect. As you see, it's transferring the world, and on the Wii U, it says, um, hang on. I'm trying to not make it blur. 
Anyways, but it says transfer complete. It's just my phone's like very bright. Uh, the camera is turned down a little. Yeah, you can kind of see it. It's a little blurry. Phone's trying to focus, but it says transfer complete. Uh, yeah, it says transfer complete on the uh, Switch and Wii U. And after that, just press A and look on the Switch version. And as you see, that same exact world, if it stopped blurring out my phone. There we go. I'm just going to zoom in. There's so many features on my phone I really don't know about. Now you see the feature, uh, that feature, <laughs> the world named JDOM is actually on the Switch version. But here's the thing. The thing says newer save version. So that's why I say you might need to use the Bedrock version. Otherwise, if you're just going to use it on the Switch, it's going to say this. It's going to say, newer save version. The save is only compatible with Minecraft 2018. Available to download free to Nintendo eShop. So, what I mean by that is that apparently this version is like the updated version. This is the outdated version because this one has aquatic update features and this one doesn't. So, I mean, it kind of makes sense because, you know, you can't really transfer worlds without the world having features like that. Unless, you know, you're playing some generic pocket edition game. Anyways, um, so what you got to do, you go to uh, Minecraft Bedrock, as you see. Alright, so Minecraft Bedrock, so unfortunately you can't play on the uh, Switch version, which that really sucks in my opinion. I agree, it really does suck. Alright, so you just close it. And, uh, it's only certified for certain users, by the way. If you, have a, if you have a user that has Minecraft Switch Edition, you can only do it for that certain user on here. Transferring worlds between users, I'm not sure. Alright, you see... Um, I'll just go here, and when you go on play, you go to your worlds basically, and you go to this thing that says uh, sync old worlds. And once you click on that, and it will start fetching your worlds from uh, well, that was fast actually. Basically, it fetches worlds from Minecraft Nintendo Switch Edition, which is right here, to Minecraft Bedrock, and it'll have all the new features and stuff like that, uh, like Bedrock, not Bedrock, like aquatic update stuff. Uh, village and pillage stuff like that. Uh, new mobs, pandas, cats, stuff like that. Dang, I seriously forgot about the update. Now, as you see, it's saying converting world because your the world isn't officially on the uh, system yet or on this version yet. Now it is, as you see. So, um, excuse me. <laughs> Anyways, as you see that world right there. Is from the Wii U version. It's kind of weird, but it works. Um, okay, you see this, that one, Jadon with the uh, forest, and there it is right there, Jadon with the forest too. Yep. All right, so let me join. Not join. Let me uh join the, the yeah join the game and <clears throat> yeah or load the world. I meant. Yeah, let me turn this volume up a little. I turned it down too far. It doesn't really take that long to uh, load a world on like this version. <laughs> Seriously, this version took like over five minutes to build a world. And as you see, that same exact world that you saw on the Wii U is actually on here. You got the mountains. Okay, that's funny. It just starts you off flying. <coughs> all right. You see, you got the mountains, the waterfall, the jungle biome all the way over there. Hang on. There you go. You got a mountain right there, forest right here. And yep, it's your exact copy from uh, Wii U. So like I said, if you're wondering that if I can uh, like play this uh, uh, play this specific world on Nintendo Switch Edition, unfortunately you can't because uh, like I said, this is the new updated version because it has aquatic update features, but on this one it doesn't. So it doesn't have like the tridents and uh, well no, no no I meant the uh, Nintendo Switch version don't have the um, tridents and stuff like that. You know, it has, like, the update before that, which is the lighter one, I believe. So, yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video, um, give it a big like and subscribe and stuff like that. And I might do more tutorial videos like this. Like, uh, let's see if we can, like, transfer mods, like, modded, uh, worlds and stuff like that to the Switch version. And I really want to try that out, because I hope it, uh, won't ban or something like that, which I believe it won't. But that would be pretty cool. I might do that soon, actually. I might actually do it. <sighs> okay, anyways. 
like and subscribe and i'll see you guys later and that is 10 minutes on the dot <laughs>